hey guys it's your girl Vanessa here welcome back to another video in today's video i share with you an amazing high growth spray that you can certainly use in your hair regimen once a week in order to stop hair loss promote healthy hair growth faster hair growth and also thicker hair so i'll definitely suggest that you keep on watching and you watch till the end of the video so you don't miss out on any useful information thank you so much if you're new here i really appreciate you checking my channel out definitely hit that subscribe button and also the notification bell so you don't miss out on any future content from me thank you so much if you're a returning subscriber i really appreciate your love and support so let's hop right into the video guys the first ingredient we're going to need for this recipe will be some green tea now green tea is amazing for hair growth now green tea has been known to help strengthen the hair roots it activates the hair follicles it helps reduce DHT which is actually something that was responsible for hair loss and it just generally makes our hair nice and healthy so I used about two I used two tea bags of green tea and basically decided to pour that in a bowl and then I'm going to go in with my next ingredient which will be some rosemary now rosemary is also really good for our hair because it stimulates blood circulation to the scalp it promotes hair growth and also it helps nourish the hair follicles and which just means it's just good for our hair in general it helps add shine and luster to the hair as well i'm using fresh um, rosemary that i got from my grocery store so pop that in with the green tea and then we're going to add some hot water to this and allow it to infuse for a few minutes okay so pretty much until the water has completely cooled down now if you want guys for this to be a bit more intense you can actually boil this so you pop this in a, on a stove and just boil it for a few minutes just to get all of that goodness out now the next inclusion guys would be some aloe vera now you guys know how much i love aloe vera aloe vera is just generally so good for our hair it helps us retain moisture it helps stimulate the hair follicles to promote healthy hair growth it prevents an itchy scalp it reduces down draft basically it has it just has some amazing properties that we certainly um can benefit from if you consider using it so as i always say guys try this and then if you don't like it then fine you can move on to the next thing i have always used aloe vera in my regimen because i've gained so much from it and i still do and it's just one of those things that i will never stop using just because of how great it is for her in general now my aloe vera is looking this way because i froze it guys now i actually did not freeze this intentionally my husband was cleaning up and i think he accidentally put my aloe vera in the freezer and when i wanted to use it i was like gosh what's happened i had to take it and then leave it out for a few minutes just to allow it to defrost and that's why it has this color um but it was still fine like it's still um as good as perhaps you know it could be um the only difference is that you know it's slightly browner in color um but that's 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 fine so yeah basically just get your aloe vera flesh out with a spoon just like i did here and then we're gonna go ahead and blend this now the longer you blend this for the more liquid consistency you are going to get so that's basically the consistency i was going for because this is a, a spray okay so i wanted it to be as liquid as possible so if you blend it for a shorter time you will get a jelly like consistency which again it will be fine but it's just that it might be a little bit difficult to get it out of your spray bottle so yeah just blend it as much as you can i used the hand blender for this but you can use your nutribula anything that you've got really so that's basically what it looks like guys and then i'm going to go ahead and strain it using a normal sieve again this could be done using anything else could be a stocking cap a tea towel anything that you've got to strain with really so i just popped that on there and just allowed it to naturally drain into the bowl and that's pretty much what i ended up with so a uh, really nice a liquid with no residue in it which was really good so 
so at this point guys my green tea and rosemary mixture had completely cooled down um so i'm just gonna strain that in the same bowl in which i have my aloe vera juice um basically just to combine everything together so at this point i did realize that i still had some bits of the green tea in the in the mixture that i ended up with so i'm gonna go ahead and strain it a bit longer using a, a tea towel in this instance so i'll suggest that you perhaps use this tea towel from the beginning just to prevent yourself having to strain it again um now the, the rosemary that i had left behind guys i did not throw that away i'm gonna keep it to use it in my next DIY because I felt like it was still green it still had some nice um, it was still fresh okay so it wasn't completely used up so if you're doing it exactly how I'm doing then definitely keep it for your next DIY but if you boil this then you might have to throw it away because you know it would be completely um, worn out if that makes sense so yeah basically i'm just using my tea towel here like i said um just to properly um strain it so i don't have anything else left in this way and that's pretty much what was left behind you can see i still had some residue and yeah i just needed to get rid of that so i don't have that stuck in my hair now i'm transferring that to my transparent bowl just because i liked it um you know you don't have to go uh, through this process again and now i'm going to go in with my avocado oil now avocado oil is also amazing for hair growth guys because it contains lots and lots of vitamins that are certainly known to help keep the hair moisturized and also um, provoke, um, promote healthy hair growth and also a healthy scalp. Now I added about a tablespoon of avocado oil but again you can add more guys if you want to. You can also use olive oil for this if you don't have avocado oil. Now I also went in with a little bit of argan oil. Argan oil is also good for hair in general. Uh, again these oils could be changed depending on what you've got available in your home um, so don't be too strict. Now the next thing would be some fragrance oil. Now I decided to add this because of the rosemary uh, because you know it just has a certain smell. It doesn't smell too bad to be honest but you know um, if perhaps you don't like your hair smelling too strong then add that fragrance oil it definitely changes the game so i added that and then i'm going in with my essential oils now i use the same essential oils guys you've seen this before i use rosemary essential oil tea tree and peppermint essential oils and these oils are definitely the bomb when it comes to promoting healthy high growth keeping a healthy scalp and basically like all of that goodness now if you're to use essential oils i definitely just that you read up on them um just so you can pick the right one but these are the ones that i recommend and these are the ones that i've always used and found benefits from so put all that in together and then mix it well and then i'm transferring that to my spray bottle which um, is just going to be easy for me to store and also to use for my hair. So this is what it looks like guys. Really nice, packed with amazing nutrients and goodness that our hair will definitely benefit from so i do hope that you try this out and if you do definitely let me know what you think of it i just think it's amazing for hair growth because of all the benefits that it contains and also it's really moisturizing for the hair you know it's got some goodness like amazing amazing ingredients in it that are certainly known to help promote hair growth now i'll definitely suggest that you are consistent guys i get this question all the time some of you guys message me in my email sometimes on instagram like how long did it take you to see results how long do i have to use this before i can see results and stuff like that what i usually say you need to be consistent okay just like with anything in life you have to be consistent to see results like if you're trying to lose weight you have to eat well consistently you have to exercise consistently and stuff like that so 
Don't expect to see results after one use. I mean, your hair will definitely be moisturized and all of that, but if you're expecting length, then it's something that you have to use consistently. I usually say three months is a good time to track changes in your hair. So perhaps if you're one of those that always measure to see you know, how many inches you've grown, it's probably not best to do that every week to be honest because you won't see a massive difference but if you check every three months for example then you can see a reasonable change if that makes sense so i would say yeah just use it consistently guys and then i promise you you will definitely notice a change now i'm just showing you guys here how i'm applying it to my hair now my hair is commonly in cornrows and i'm just applying it between the tracks and also making sure that you know it goes all over my scalp and also all over my cornrows and massaging that in nicely and then i'm also applying it to my ends just so i can keep them nice and moisturized and healthy uh, and also as healthy as they can be so massage that on there nicely you know put it on your ends and all of that and that's pretty much it you know it's this part is particularly light so you can use it every single day of the week if you want to or you can even use it once a week i mean it's really powerful and also really good at keeping your hair nice and moisturized so you don't necessarily have to reapply too often but i'll suggest that you know you apply it once or twice a week definitely to see improvement now this is pretty much it for me today guys thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it if you made it to this point of the video thank you so much for that also like the video guys it's so important because that helps youtube push my videos out to more people so that you know other people can learn from it as well and also benefit from it just like you have so definitely hit that like button and also subscribe if you're not already share with your friend your family anyone you believe could benefit from this and subscribe if you're not already and i'll catch you next time bye